All right, team. This is the one of the ones I wanted to come and show you. It's not the fuck you, fuck off one, but this is pretty close. Tui and I found this the other night, but it was dark. Look at that. Look at those beautiful, beautiful verandas, balconies, not verandas, that's very Australiana. I mean, balconies. Look at the stonework on this thing. How special. Of course, we can contrast it to the ugliness of modern day. But look at that. And of course, it goes all the way down the street. The one I actually want to show you is behind me. <laughs> you just hang on in there, Tartarian Hunters. But just to give us an idea of the whole street, some giant columns there. Look at that, I see a pentagon. This is all mud flood. This whole strip here is mud flood. The whole thing goes down. And then we've got this column building there and then this gorgeous Regent Theatre here. Another beautiful theatre. Isn't that beautiful? And then I'm just going to turn around and walk back up the street to the more and more and more and more and more beautiful, powerful architecture. So I don't know what time it is. I think it's like 8.30 or something in the morning. I've come out before my noble day starts. So I run a charity, by the way. Um, transitioning farmers to regenerative agriculture which is good service you know noble work but I don't know in light of Titaria it feels like we're scratching around in the dirt in the devil's playground regenerating so this is just beautiful as well of course I can never give you the scale when I'm right underneath it and quite busy which means I can't just stand on the road and then we've got some uh, giant Colim Colosseum here why not so it's very um, Melbourne's mixture of architecture is very unusual don't you think I've got the big contrasting spaces once again steps leading up cracks I can see cracks in the pavement <laughs> Of course it goes down and down and down but um we're still on Collins Street so if you don't even you don't even think about Tatara you wouldn't even think about this building like why is it here what wonder when they said it was built there'll be some bullshit plaque somewhere I was just checking out yeah it's been all cemented up but all right are you guys ready? <laughs> I'm about to take you to Camelot. Camelot on Collins Street. Get fucked. Hello. What? Camelot and fucking Collins Street. What? <laughs> this is fuck. What? Oh man, oh man. Look at that. Look at this. I mean, this looks like freaking Harry Potter. We don't need a, a musical symbolizing it. See if I can see the bullshit about when it was built. Going to go up. So this style is quite classic here in Melbourne. You know, we've, I've showed you my very first video. We're showing you essentially <laughs> like this is just a jewelry shop and a bookshop just here Melbourne City Collins Street the main street into the city it's reopen now uh, I can't find a date oh silly me here it is that little blue park 1873 uh, gothic revival style what the fuck does that even mean gothic fucking revival style what the fuck are you talking about 
When do we even have a gothic time period to revive? So let's just go up. Have a lot here in Melbourne City. Beautifully contrasted by West Peck Bank. I do love the contrast, the old world and the new world together. So, how's this? The castle in the middle of the city. We'll go have a look. Of course, it just leads on to, I mean, it must have been one interconnected power station, I reckon. Because right beside it is the cathedral. Don't you love all these dominating new and old world? Like, we've got the new and the old world. So, <laughs> lovely little power station. Connecting. Let's see if I go up here, get a good view of what's So yeah, there you go. Who said we did not have princesses and princes and kings and queens and unicorns and mythical fucking forests and creatures here in Melbourne or Australia, the ancient world. <laughs> so I, can, I could be anywhere right now. I mean, I'd like to be anywhere right now. I reckon Tui and I would like to be anywhere else right now, to be fair. But while we're here, and while consciousness is on the move, we'll commit our time to capturing through the lens of truth and consciousness, at this point, Tartaria. Because of course, I am the first to acknowledge there is so much more to come, far out. So we got Camelot, Dark City, Gotham, back in England, power station. It's a nice ending shot, don't you think? And a Melbourne tram, just to prove that I haven't stepped back in time. <laughs>